Sure. In the the programme for government acknowledges that this commission of investigation into 14 mother and baby homes and other ancillary issues. In March of this year, going back to March, they reported that there were discovery of juvenile human remains in significant quantities in subsurface chambers on the site of a historic sewage system. Following that discovery, uh, an expert technical group was set up on the 1st of June. Commendably, they reported with their options at the end of June and gave their full report at the end of September. It is now December and this is the first time that we have got sight of that report, notwithstanding that the report outlines that transparency is of the utmost, a culture of transparency should be cultivated and so on. It also acknowledges, despite the good efforts of the Minister Sapone, that no agency, department or organisation has an acknowledged role in coordinating the work. Now, Taoiseach, at this point, can you clarify why it has taken so long to publish the report, given that you had the options available to you at the end of June, the full report available at the end of September. And secondly, can you confirm that this will be put down for open discussion in this stall in the interests Thank of you, openness Deputy. and transparency? Uh, yeah, um, I, I, I may be mistaken, but um, I, I'm fairly sure the, the um, Cabinet gave Minister Zappone uh, approval to uh, publish the report um, just at Cabinet this week. Um, obviously, uh, we're in our hands as to when uh, the report um, uh, is published uh, in terms of the, the ordering of the debate and times in the House. That's a matter for the Business Committee. Deputy